period. I'm open my sunroof. Come on, uh uh, this car is showing out. This car, no, they don't do this to me. <laughs> Baby. No, you don't do this to me, boo boo. Impress when it's time to impress, okay? But, <laughs> uh, hey y'all. So, y'all, as y'all can tell by that title, today I'm gonna be doing a Chipotle. This Chipotle, yeah, <laughs> Chipotle mukbang. I'm gonna be, um, venting a lot too as y'all can see your girl is in that gym wear today is february 1st baby we starting over ladies we starting over and doing what we need to do okay whatever goals you got whatever don't don't hit the lamborghini don't hit don't hit the lumber okay all right um no but whatever goals y'all got and whatever y'all want to do it's a fresh month Go start, y'all. I'm supposed to start at the gym January 1st, but I've been going through some shit in my head. So, I'm, it ain't never too late to start. I'm starting right now, February 1st. Hello. Get with me. Got that gym uniform on. Yeah, I just came from the gym. Today, I worked on my arms, my glutes, and I worked on my um my stomach, y'all. My stomach is still burning and my arms are burning. So, I feel like I did a good job, y'all. I did an excellent job with them crunches today, though. Let me show y'all what I got. Out. I got my white rice. I got chicken for the protein. Yeah, 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 yeah. I got corn, tomatoes, and I got extra guacamole. Okay, cause we trying to get that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We trying to get that all up in there. Okay. Period, y'all. Oh my God, I ain't had Chipotle in since I've been pregnant with Papa, y'all. So, this is my first time eating Chipotle in like four months, four, five months. But, mmm. Mmm. Yeah. I was so hungry. Oh, what's tea? What's tea? What's tea? What's tea? If y'all got me on Facebook, I know y'all been seeing that your girl been going on a rant, okay? Mmm. Yeah. I ain't had no real good, I ain't had no real breakfast. All I had was like a granola bar. And I drank two bottles of water. And I drank some um, bloating stuff. And that's all I had. So, this right here this right here is hidden right now. So, excuse me, y'all. I'm hungry. I know I'm hungry because I got a headache. But no, let me get into the tea. So, if you got me on Instagram, if you got me on Facebook, you know I've been going on a rant or whatever. But that's because mm -hmm, I just thought I'm tired of people BS, you know? Like, I don't got no time. I always had, I'm sorry, y'all. It's good. Let me get to the point for real. Hold on. Mmm. <laughs> like, y'all, I always had goals for myself. I always knew what I wanted. And I always knew how I wanted my future to be. I wanted to be okay financially, even if even if I don't be the most richest person or this or that. I always just wanted to be okay that I could take care of myself and my kids and pay for us to live nice and have a roof over our head. And then you know, I always I wanted a husband and I wanted the kids, whatever. So my life, I'm not complaining. But if that wasn't your goals then why do it you know and i'm speaking on like the other person like if that if that's not your goals then why do it you get what i'm saying like if that wasn't your goals then why do it and can nobody say they was forced to do anything they was forced to marry me they was forced to be with me they was forced to move to atlanta they was forced to do this they was forced to do that can nobody ever say i forced them to do anything anything that happened it, it was because they wanted to do it 
okay so like all this switching up that i feel like people doing switching up want to be sneaky i guess want to talk to people and all of a sudden you unhappy and and you know i can't help if a person unhappy you know but move around don't stick to somewhere that you are happy you feel me like don't stick around because i know i wouldn't don't stick around nowhere that you are not happy. I don't care. People then people on Facebook somebody. It's uh when kids involved, when baby, it's called co-parent. What do you mean? So you finna stick around somewhere unhappy because the kids grew up these kids. What you mean? You ain't never heard of that, baby. It's called co-parenting. And it's better for that's why that's why a lot of kids grow up traumatized. Because the shit that went on in the household, because the parents were unhappy, but trying to stay together for the family and for the kids. No, if you're unhappy, it's better for our kids to see us happy and we can raise them right together, co-parenting, than to see us together sad, miserable, unhappy. Y'all get what I'm saying? Like, people need to make sense. Like, I'm not no goofy. Like, if y'all, you know, with me, I'm not no goofy. Are you so unhappy? Like you say you is, don't use the kids or no relationship to stick around. Like you need to be, you get one life to live. Go be happy. That's all I'm saying. I'm 27 and I'm going to be happy. No matter what. I do what I want to do. I say what I want to say. And I be me. And I'm, I'm me all the way around, 24-7 around anybody and everybody because you have one life to live, baby. And I want to live my life. I don't want to live nobody else's life. I don't want to live for nobody or none of that. I want to live my life. So, that's where I'm just at with it right now. Am I single? Yes. As of right now, I am single. Because ain't nobody going to play with me. You're not going to play in my face twice. That's what you're not going to do. You're not playing in my face twice. I don't care who you is. Mama, sister, cousin daughter son i don't care you're not gonna pay in my face twice you're not that's what you're not gonna do so and that goes back to i'm gonna be happy no matter what and people say you can't be single and you married how come how come how come how come what should i say separated that what y'all want to hear separated Baby, I'm single, <laughs> ready to mingle. If you got them bands to make her dance, hit me up. Nah, <laughs> no, I'm going to be happy. No matter what I said this year, no matter what, I'm going to be happy. One of my goals was to get in the gym, get my body right. I want to get my man right. I want to work harder, make more money. And if you're not on the same page as that, baby, move around. That's why I keep telling people, move around. Why it's so hard for you to move around? Like, don't use the kids, the family, the this, the that. It's no excuse. Move, baby, it's called co-parenting. You grown. Motherfuckers, motherfuckers at that, we past 25 now. You have to live. Motherfuckers drop it like flies. You have to live your life. Don't think, don't think you hurting the next person. Because you made the choice that you want to leave or that you like unhappy and stuff. The the other person might be, you know, a little unhappy and sad, but hey, they ha that's something they have to deal with. That is something they have to deal with. Like And then another thing Don't 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 get nobody done. I'm sorry y'all, this is so good. Mm. It's guacamole fresh. I can tell. Another thing, y'all. Don't ever... You know you don't want to be with a person. Stop leading them on. That's how you get dealt with. You know? <laughs> like, don't leave a, leave a person. Oh, if you so unhappy and you don't want to be in a in, in so-and-so -so situation... Don't leave nobody on. Don't be want to be unhappy one day, and then the next day leave the person on. Don't be unhappy one day, then next leave the person on. Then I want to be unhappy again. Then you want to leave the person on, cause it's not gonna go like that, especially not with me. 
I'm not one of them females you can walk all over. I'm not one of them females that's, you know, off in the head. I'm not one of them. I have my own brain. I have my own heart. So I know what I bring to the table. I know I know my worth. I know what I've done. You know, so that's all I'm saying. Just, just, just if you if you go um, and I and then also people need to learn how to be a hundred. If you feel like you want to do you, you want to talk to other females, you want to be around other females, or you want something new, say that. And, and don't get me wrong, it have been said before. But like I said, don't say that one day, then the next day you lean the person on. Like, stay ten toes down on what you want to do. Don't be one day, because I'm not going to lie to y'all, it's been said. People want to do them. They want to see other people try out new things. Okay, cool. But the next day, don't be leading no person on. Let me, don't be selling no dreams because that's how you get dealt with. You feel me? That's how you get dealt with. Then the next day, you want to do you. Then the next day, you want to be under me. Then the next day, you want to do you. Then you want to be under me. It don't work like that. I don't know who you who raised you, but it don't work like that over here. I told, I keep telling people, I'm not one of them females that you you could do you and still come up, come out, come home, or as long as he come home, I'm not one of them females. Uh -uh. Baby, by the time you come home, it's gonna be a. Uh, 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 uh. <laughs> okay. My real bitches know. The real bitches know. I don't want to hear all that phony shit. That's another thing I like. I don't like phony, fake ass shit. Especially if you've never been in a situation. Let's be real about a, the situation. I don't want to do no counseling. I don't want to do no therapy. I don't want to do none of that, baby. Like I said, I'm not spending no 25, 50 uh, hour, two hour minute in no. You know what? I could, I could be. I could be smoking my hookah, drinking my wine with them two hours. I'm not finna sit in no therapy thing for a bunch of bullshit. When the motherfucker told me what it was already. That that's just stupid to me. Like, no. Can't nobody tell me what this motherfucker just told me. He he don't he wanna do him, he he want something new. So what a therap when I'm paying all that money and sitting there wasting that time for a uh, Lord fix it, please. Please fix it. That be what wrong with people. That's why I, that be what wrong with people. You want to go to therapy after a motherfucker just told you what the therapist going to tell you. I just told you. I don't want to be with you. So we're going to pay all that money and sit there for hours for the therapy, the therapist, to tell you he don't want to be with you. Like, he just told you that at home for free. You feel me? Like, uh-uh. I could be at home doing some doing some better things than sitting up in the, no damn therapy thing looking stupid. Kudos to you if you did it. But me, I ain't wasting my time like that. Mm -mm, baby. Move on, you move on, I move on. Like, and then people saying, like, are y'all really married? Like, do y'all got a certificate? Everything is official. Everything is legal. We are actually married. We actually signed that paper. Most of y'all know we actually had a wedding. But like I said, all that don't mean nothing to me. Like, I don't care. Um, we could have been married 50 years. I don't care. That don't mean nothing to me. But ain't nobody going to tell me they want to do that or they don't want to be with me twice. You not. You have to move around. Like, I don't know. People playing both sides right now. I don't know what it is. My thing is just stand on what you need to stand on. Cause then, cause when it's time, when it's my time, I'm gonna stand on it. Y'all feel me? You know, it is what it is. And don't think a person is a bad person, or. Don't think somebody is a bad person. Got this damn phone say I ain't had no storage. But yeah, like I was saying, y'all, people 
people just be wanting new things and that's fine like this is life like i don't believe nobody i truly don't believe nobody could help their feelings because when i'm feeling sad i can't help my feelings when i'm happy i can't help my feelings that's like that's how you feel can't nobody stop you from feeling the way you feel like so you know you you get angry you get upset but you still gotta realize you know you can't help how that person feel that person wants something new out of life out of their one life that they get to live you can't be mad at that you cannot be mad at that yes you could be angry you could be heartbroken but i dealt with it like a lot of shit so i learned a lot of shit like I'm numb almost, y'all. I'm not all the way numb because I still get my feelings involved, but I'm almost numb to where, like, I completely don't give a fuck because I've been through so much shit with people, like, like, <laughs> I could count on my hand how many relatives I got. I could count on one hand how many friends I got. That lets you know right there, like, I don't get my feelings involved no more. What's for me, gonna be for me. Mm -hmm. I don't know y'all. I'm just telling y'all how I feel. You know. And give y'all a tea of what's going on. So long story short, I guess people want something new. And they want to do now. So... I guess that is what it is. I'm over it now. Mm. Y'all won't see me ranting on face, ranting on Facebook <laughs> and sharing shady shit on my Instagram. Mm. Like yeah. Mm. Yeah, this is good. But y'all, yeah, I'm so happy. I got up. I got my ass up. I took my baby to school. And I got my ass up, put on my gym clothes, and I went my ass. It was hard because I wanted to lay back down because it was so early. But no, I trained my man. I said, nope, get up, go to the gym. Get up, go to the gym. Get up, go to the gym, y'all. And I did it. And I'm so proud of myself. And that's just step one for me to train my brain and my mental to just keep going and do what I need to do this year to reach my goals. You know? Mm. Mm. Your girl Edge is coming back. Don't play with it. Don't play with it. Don't play with it. Don't play with it. Yeah. You see your girl Edge is coming back. They coming back slowly but surely, but I've been greasing them up and stuff. And they coming back. They coming back. I'm going to see what some of my, like, what's, what's some of my tea. My answer was I'm single. Yes. Are we really married? Yes. Mm. I basically told y'all what happened. Uh, he wants to see other people. He wants something new. Um, what else? What else to tea? I basically told y'all how I feel. I was hurt a little bit, but I'm cool now. I gotta do what's best for me. And at the end of the day, I don't know what it's gonna take us, or because, like I said, people play both sides. Like, it's, it's this or this. Like, it, it can't be both. It's this or this. It can't be both. So, I don't know how all this is going to last. I don't know um, where it's going to go from here. But I'm not playing no games. Like, I'm not here to play. I'm not going to stick around and play no games till you done figuring out that you want something new. Or when you went out there and tried something new. Now you want to come. No. Uh-uh. Mm. And I'm not going to be waiting on nobody. Period. Oh. Uh, you know. 
Time will tell. For sure. Yeah, I don't know if I should start my own channel. Let me know. My thing with starting my own channel, I don't know what to do every day. I don't do nothing. I take care of my kids at home, and that's it. And I might go out on the weekend sometimes, y'all. I don't do nothing. Like, I know somebody on TikTok said they want, to do, want me to do a story time of, like, a fight I had and my first time losing my, when I lost my V. I think I'm going to do a story time when I lost my V, because it was just, it was hilarious, y'all. That, that's some tea. That's some tea. I might do that story time this week. Cause that's some tea. But I don't know. Comment below if y'all think I should start my own page and what should I do on there. Cause y'all, I don't, I don't, I don't do no hair. I don't do makeup. I don't do nothing. So my my pay my channel will be like so dry, y'all. Like ain't nothing for me to do on there. It's hard to come up with content. For a personal channel you feel me it's hard because like especially if you don't do not you don't have a life like me i don't have a life i just take care of my kids work and we be chilling the house chilling we might go out some weekends and that's it mm. but y'all yeah. I miss my papa. I've been at the gym since now. It is. It's 12.43. I've been at the gym since now. So I'm finna go home, wash my ass, hug and kiss on my papa because I miss my baby. Y'all, I love my baby so much. I love my son so much. That's my everything right there. I love my son so much. He am so cute. Him so cute. But... That's the tea, y'all. Comment down below. Let me know how y'all feel. Don't comment with all that therapy shit. I don't want to hear it. Because I'm not doing it. I don't want to hear work it out. Ain't nothing to work out with a person who clearly told you. That's be y'all problem. Y'all be letting and females tell y'all multiple times that they don't want y'all. Or they want this. Or they want to step out. See, I, you ain't got to tell me twice. Go on, do you. And I'm going to do that. Period. You ain't got to tell me twice. Mm -mm. No, you don't. You don't got to tell me twice. Because I mean, just like you want to try something new, I might want something bigger and better. <laughs> that was shade. That was shade. That was shade. You know, so. Mm. <laughs> to the left, to the left. <laughs> yeah, but yeah. Yeah. So, tilt that. I really just banged that, like for real. I really just embarrassed myself eating like that. But. Yeah, it's a track team walking up and all these girls got flat stomachs. Oh my god. Don't nobody care. Cause y'all got a flat stomach. Man coming soon. Watch. Y'all gonna see, give me three months. Three months in the gym, five days a week. Yeah. Yeah, Xavier had that. Yeah. I'm gonna get rid of this. I'm gonna get rid of this. Just wait and see y'all. I'm ready. I'm on my own shit this year. I'm on my. I'm getting my shit together. Yeah, I'm ready, y'all. Just stay tuned. Like this video. I love y'all. Comment down below if I should start my own channel. And comment down below how y'all feel. Uh, just don't get cursed out in the comments because I just told y'all what not to comment. For real. Don't let nobody play with y'all. They shouldn't play with y'all at all. But you know we give people chances in life. But don't let people play with you multiple times. You know, just don't. I don't care who it is. Do not let people play with you multiple times. Because not only is people going to continue to play with you, you're going to start letting people play with you constantly. So, no, cut that shit dead that first time or that, that, that second time. No more than that. 
Second strike, you out. Fuck three strikes. Second strike. <sighs> like, for real, that's that's why I'm at, at, at finna be 28 this year. I'm 27, finna be 28 this year. I don't, I don't got time for games. I got a couple, I got a couple more states I need to travel. I need to go overseas about 30 more times. Mm -mm. I, don't, mm -mm. I don't got time. I don't. Yeah, but on this page, I am going, I never did it, but I am going to do a night routine and a morning routine with Z and Papa. I'm going to do that story time when I lost my V and I might do a story time. Uh, my, my, I ain't gonna do my first fight because I remember. I'll probably do the time I got jumped out west in Chicago. <laughs> when I got snaked, I'll probably do that story every time. Y'all comment below if y'all wanna hear that. And I'm going home to my papa, y'all. I love y'all and I'm out. That's the tea.